Welcome back to Sanks to Sank TV. We've reached a final segment of our show, and it, it's been such a great pleasure to have oh, you, you come back and grace us with your presence and your energy, your vibe. Listen, I love it. <laughs> Especially in a time right now where everything is so down I know. and depressing. Yeah. And, oh, thank God we live in South Florida, too. We oh, have yeah. the dreary weather. And, oh. We are here to pick you up. Yep. Yes, you are. And we yes, love we the weather down here for sure. <laughs> Before, nice. before you give us our your credential handles mm -hmm. and where can we you know find more information about you and your upcoming events, I just want to hit on something really quickly that I feel like I kind of like glossed over, and it's Melina. Like mm -hmm. you are in the center of even though we've we've gone so far, we've gotten so far as far as women is concerned in the industry, but the fact that you are in this male dominated you know industry and mm -hmm. you're that lady that's up there representing for us. I know that you have a lot to do with that mm -hmm. as far as your father. Yes. So I want to know, like, how does it feel to be in that space? And what does it feel that you have paved the way for her to be in that space? So two part question. Wow, that's yes. a good question. Mm -hmm. <laughs> well, first of all, uh, for me, it's an uh, honor and a privilege. And I see it as my life's work, really. Um, I don't want to put anybody down yeah. mm -hmm. <laughs> but it can be very difficult um, and you know there's I've had amazing men and ladies that have been very supportive of my career uh, Tito being the number one um, also his wife is also mm -hmm. very supportive of, of, of me and my my dream and my talent and everything but I've also had you know a lot of people that have given me a lot of opportunities here and there uh, so you just have to like I said before you just have to take those opportunities and make the best of each day each moment uh you know with pride yes. and 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 elegance because that's what uh i want women to see from my side uh, i want people to see that you can make it that you can do it that you can be per you can work just as hard as the men mm -hmm. you know you can do as well as the men um it is possible uh it's difficult but it's difficult for them as well Absolutely. it's not hard for it's not easy for them so right. you have to think you know a lot of people say oh but they're men no no mm -hmm. it's hard it's always hard yeah. Yeah. you know form of beast. we yeah. work together tito puente kept a tradition of really utilizing his platform throughout his entire career by giving other people opportunities. Mm -hmm. Whether it becomes the percussion players or the horn players, uh, Patato, Ray Barreto, all these great yeah. musicians that work with Tito Puente, Charlie Palmieri, La India, Mark Anthony, mm -hmm. all these great, great musicians all got that platform and that opportunity to work with my father because he opened the door for them. Mm -hmm. Opened up the door for most Latin musicians that you hear and see today. Right. That includes all across the board, whether it comes to reggaeton, hip hop, salsa, mambo, anything, Tito Puente is really a pioneer in that. Not only did, that, did he do that, but he also gave the opportunity for women at that time, back in the mm -hmm. 1940s, 50s, and 60s, to front his orchestra. So mm -hmm. I keep with the tradition of my father by putting Melina in front of my orchestra, and I'll make sure that everybody shows her respect when she comes <laughs> up on that stage, and you're gonna hear an amazing yeah. voice, because I want you to listen to her talent. Yeah, I heard it's the about, come out. Yeah, yeah, it's about that. It's about hearing her voice <laughs> and how she can really engage the crowd, too. Yes, yes. And that's really the fun part about working with her and traveling around the world. Great stuff. Yeah. Where can we contact you for more information and up and coming events? Ooh, come follow me. Everybody else does. It's <laughs> doing the IRS. Ah, you're so <laughs> so silly. come follow me. Uh, you can follow me on all my social media pla platforms at Tito Puente Junior, Facebook, Twitter, uh, mm -hmm. Instagram, and of course TikTok. My kids got me oh, doing the TikTok, TikTok thing. Okay. Um, so yeah, it. follow me there. And you can follow <laughs> Melina. Please tell them how. Yes, on Instagram, Melina Salsa Music. And on Facebook, Melina Salsa. I'm not on TikTok yet. I'm not a TikToker. <laughs> I'm going to get I'm a pull kid. there. He's trying. He's not trying to get me up there. <laughs> yes. So yeah, follow us. And of course, come out on um, December 31st for the great concert yes. that we're having on New Year's Eve at the Renaissance Ballroom. All the information are, all, are, are on our social media platforms. Thank you yes. so much again yeah. for joining us at Sanctuary Sanct TV. Listen, I had a shout out to Blaze Law Firm as well as the Haitian American Chamber of Commerce. Listen, thank you, thank you, thank you. I can't thank you enough. If you want more information about us, please feel free to log on to www.sinkstosinktv.com. I am B. Longchamp. I can be located on Instagram at <laughs> B. Longchamp. Yeah. And both of our Twitter and Instagram handles are at sinkstosinktv.com. Till next time. Yay! Yes, yeah. <laughs> I'm looking cross-eyed because I was looking <laughs>